Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Game, and today in this video, I'm going to show you how to install add ons on Elder Scrolls Online. To do this, we're going to be using something called Minion. So just go to google.com and type in Minion right here, and then we want to go to this URL, minion.mmoui.com, and then go ahead and download this to your computer. Most of you probably will have Windows 64 bit. Just go ahead and download this and then install it. So I already have it installed, so I'm gonna select this and open it back up. And it says the install minion. Do you wish to continue? Yes, so let's go to yes. So here it is. Go ahead and close this down in the background and go to next and choose location. So I'm gonna to go to next. I'm just gonna let my computer decide this. All right, so it is now installing. If you have a specific location you wanna go ahead and install it, go ahead. But I'm just gonna to go to my C drive. So let's go to launch minion right here. Go to finish. And I should be able to start it up if it doesn't launch. So here he is. Now, if it ever gets to the point where it's just a um, blank screen, go ahead and shut it down and then restart start it. Sometimes you won't be able to add the Elder Scrolls Online. Now, if I go to the plus icon here, we want to add the add-on folder. So this might pop up automatically for you. I'm gonna to go to the Elder Scrolls Online and we wanna to go to documents. So let's scroll all up and find documents then find the Elder Scrolls Online and go to live and then here's add-ons. So select this folder and add it. And then you wanna go ahead and restart the client and Elder Scrolls Online should be added here now. Now to search for uh, an add-on, we can go to find more. You can see they're already showing up. So you can go to the search if you have something specifically you wanna go ahead and look for. See, I probably wanna go to sort out by downloads or favorites or something like that, just to see what's the most popular. So it looks like these are right here. The things that are displaying on the top. So sky shards are something I definitely need coming from the council version. So let's install that. Lore books, oh, definitely need that. Harvest map, destinations. Uh, I don't know what this is. Lazy writ crafter. Well, sounds pretty good. Let's go ahead and do that. Map pins. Okay. I can always disable this later on. Combat metrics. Okay, whatever. Lost treasures. Action duration reminders. Probably don't need that. So those are probably the best ones for me just to have on right now. So I'll wait for those to install. So once I do that, oh, what's this awesome guild store? Once I do that, I have these installed. It looks like they're installed. I can go ahead and start Elder Scrolls Online now. Let's go ahead and just start this up. Go to play. And it is now running. Then when we're in the game, we can go ahead and toggle the add-ons. So this launches on the incorrect screen. You can hold down shift and the windows button and then use the arrow key to move it on over to your desired screen. So let's do windows shift arrow key and boom, there's Elder Scrolls Online. So that helps a lot. So let's go ahead and log in here. I can remember my password. And we should be able to just toggle the add-ons on or off. If we don't want one on specifically, well, we can just toggle it off. So right here we can see add-ons and here's all my add-ons. Now it says they're out of date, but that is fine. So I'm just going to go ahead and just leave them on. We can always find up-to-date ones later. So let's go back into the game now. Go to my characters and log in and see if anything looks different in the game. So I'm open, it does. I was playing for maybe about a thousand plus hours on the PlayStation 5 and 4 over the last 10 years. So it is nice to have way shards or the ability to find those easy. So press M. You can see the lore books on here. Oh my gosh, that's going to make everything so much easier. Uh, let's see. Do I have any of the shrines on here? I think I already did them. Oh, here's one down here. How would I do the pins? So it's going to take you a little bit to figure out all the different add-ons once you go ahead and install those. But you can see just on the map, I have the setup for my controller. Oh, what's this little treasure box right here? 
Oh, that is so great. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If did, leave it a big thumbs up. Subscribe my channel down below for more checkout videos coming up next on Your Six Gaming.